Hello dear students, in trick number 309, I am going to deal with a very very important part of mental mathematics that is mental addition. Now let me tell you that if someone is comfortable in adding numbers mentally, then multiplication becomes very very easy. So if you are trying to increase your speed of multiplication, then you have to follow the steps which I tell you in part 1 of my mental addition tricks. Now in this in inaugural video of mental addition, I will take up very small things about addition which you need to take care of when you try to increase your speed of calculation. Now see single digit addition is very very easy. Obviously if I ask you to add 3 plus 5 anyone can tell me that it is 8 and simultaneously if I ask you 8 plus 9 you can tell me that it is 17. So if you are comfortable in one digit single digit multipli uh, multiplication and also addition then multiplication addition division everything becomes very easy. So I am going to take up two digit additions in this video so that we can learn step by step and once we are comfortable with two digit additions we can extrapolate this method for three digits also. So let us take one example of adding 13 and 44. Okay, very simple example. Now I know most of you must be feeling comfortable and you must already have thought the answer in your mind. But what is the thought process in our mind when we see numbers like this to be added together? Now see anyone who adds from the right hand side that is from the units place is following the traditional method but this is a simple example but when we get on to the complex examples things become little bit complicated. At that time you need to add mentally using place value. Now see what I do is I will break now see I am writing all the steps just to tell you but everything done on the board is done mentally not by writing. So don't think that I am if I am writing it in four steps you have to follow those four steps. You can skip all the steps and get on to the last step in a matter of just three to four seconds only. So see this is a two digit number having ones place or the units place and the tens place. So what we do is we will separate out see 13 is 10 so 1 followed by a 0 and 3 and 44 is 4 this one and followed by a 0 because it is in tens place and 4 and now round figure addition is very easy 10 plus 40 is 50 and 3 plus 4 is 7 so you get 57 as the answer. Now this is just a demonstration now see we can take up some questions where traditional addition will be little bit difficult for small children 28 plus 37 now see if, if they add 8 plus 7 obviously they will get a 2 digit number here so what they do is see 2 followed by a 0 and 8 3 followed by a 0 and 7 so now 20 plus 30 is 50 and 8 plus 7 single digit addition is 15 now this 15 can also be broken down into 10 plus 5 so this is 60 and 5 that gives you 65. Mind you I am writing all the steps just to tell you these are all mental steps these are not to be written and practice of 10 to 15 minutes of mental addition I think will enable you to add any number mentally very very easily. Now see one more example. Say we have 49 and 65. See 4, 0, plus 9, plus 6, 0, plus 5. 60 plus 40 is 100, very easy. And 9 plus 5 is 14, 100 plus 14 is 114. Every step takes place in mind. So whenever you add mentally, just follow the place value from the left hand side. And now I am going to reduce the steps in some of the illustrations which I am going to give you now. See this is 83 plus 68. Now see 
80 plus 60 is 140 and 3 plus 8 is 11 so you get 151 as the answer more, more examples so you have 97 plus 56 see 9 plus 5 is 14 followed by a 0 and 7 plus 6 is 13 so 140 plus 13 153 which is the required sum that's here see the 100 place here 1 and here it is 3 so 1 plus 3 gives you 4 and since it is the 100th place you write two zeros after that then add the tens places so 2 plus 4 is 6 followed by 1 0 because it is the tens place so 1 0 and then add the unit digits 1 and 6 this is 7 now very 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 easy 460 plus 7 that is 467 is the answer now these steps also take place in mind and whenever you see the numbers and by looking at it you can tell the answer see very easy now 6 plus 2 8 followed by 2 zeros 3 plus 8 11 followed by 1 0 and 2 plus 1 3 so this is 800 plus 100 910 plus 3 this is 913 see 8 plus 4 12 followed by 2 zeros 1 plus 5 6 followed by 1 0 and 3 plus 6 9 so this is 1200 and plus 69 this is 1269 so viewers you don't need to write these steps i am just writing steps just to tell you the sequence of steps you need to think in your mind this is not to be written just to be thought so some more examples here see this is 917 plus 162 9 plus 1 10 followed by two zeros 1 plus 6 7 followed by 1 0 and 7 plus 2 9 so 1000 79 2 plus 5 7 followed by 2 zeros 3 plus 6 9 followed by 1 0 and 8 plus 2 10 so this is 790 plus 10 is 800 7 plus 4 11 followed by 2 zeros 2 plus 2 4 followed by 1 0 9 plus 3 12 so this is 1100 and this is 52 so 52 so you see addition becomes so simple and you don't have to use the traditional method of writing the two numbers one below the other and then adding vertically this is to be done using the place values and if you have the knowledge of these shortcuts you are going to increase your ski speed of calculation by at least four to five times of what you are doing today so Keep on viewing the subsequent parts of this series of videos on mental addition. In my subsequent video, part 3, I will be dealing with much bigger numbers and what happens when we have to add numbers having different number of digits. Say here we have 3 digits, 3 digits, equal number of digits. But if we have to add 3 digits and 2 digits, what are we going to do? That is to be done in my next part of this 4. Now see, obviously this digit is now free independent because there is no corresponding digit in the second number so what we do is we just write the place value of this 7 is in the hundreds place so we write 700 and now our task is just to add 28 and 84 that can be done using the place values now see 2 plus 8 is 10 and since 2 and 8 are at the tens place we write 10 and then add the units place 8 plus 4 12 now see very very easy 700 800 and 12 812 is the correct answer get another demonstration see now 3 is independent so write 300 because it is on the 100th place now use the digits at the 10th place 4 plus 6 is 10 followed by 1 0 and then add the digits at the units place 6 plus 3 is 9 next step is very very easy 300 400 9 so 409 is the answer see 900 to be added to 6 plus 4 10 followed by 10 and 8 6 plus 2 8 so 900 1010 
H is the answer. Take take this up. See two two is here, so two hundred. Nine plus eight is seventeen, followed by one zero, and eight plus six is fourteen. So two hundred plus one seventy plus fourteen one eighty four. So three eighty four is the answer. See five is three here, so five hundred. Nine plus seven is sixteen, followed by one zero, and four plus seven is eleven. So this is five hundred six sixty and eleven six hundred and seventy one. Now see six is three here, so six hundred, followed by four plus nine thirteen and one zero, and then eight plus six fourteen. So either you can add these two or you can add these two to get your final answer. C six hundred seven thirty plus fourteen, so seven hundred and forty four is the taking two thousand three hundred and forty six plus five twenty six. Now see number of digits here is three, and here if we consider last three digits, then two is left behind. So just write the place value of two. Two is in the thousands place, so you need to write three zeros after this. And now just add the corresponding digits. C three plus five is eight, followed by two zeros because it is in the hundred place. Four plus two is six, followed by one zero because it is in the tens place. And six plus six is in the ones place. So just add them and write it as it is. And now do as per your convenience. How you feel comfortable adding these four numbers because they are basically round figures. So two thousand eight hundred sixty plus twelve. So this is two thousand eight hundred sixty plus twelve is seventy two. So you get your answer. Two three four six plus five twenty six is two eight seven two. Viewers, I am writing these steps just to tell you how mental addition takes place. But you don't need to write these steps if you practice this method for half an hour. because while looking at the number you can tell me the exact addition of these numbers now see here here we have four digits here we have four digits so nothing is uh, more in one of the numbers so what we do here is just add the corresponding numbers on the thousands place so here you see thousands place 2 plus 5 is 7 and you need to put three zeros after this because it is the thousands place so thousand contains three digits now add the numbers at the Hundred place nine plus one ten, and you need to put two more zeros because they are the numbers on the hundredth place. Then the, add the numbers on the tens place eight plus three eleven, followed by one zero and one plus two three. This is the sequence of numbers which you have to follow for getting the first step. Now after this. Add as per your convenience: seven thousand, eight thousand, eight thousand, one hundred and ten, eight thousand, one hundred and ten plus three, ten plus three is thirteen, so thirteen. Eight thousand one hundred and thirteen is the sum of these two numbers. You don't need to write it one below the other and then add vertically to get the answer. In that case, you will be carrying numbers and may be committing some errors. Now, in the third question, here you can see. We have three digits here, three digits here. So six is three. So six comes in the thousand place. So six thousand will be left left alone like this. And now add the corresponding digits. Three plus six nine. It is on the hundredth place. So double zero. Four plus two six. It is on the tens place. So one zero. And eight plus three eleven. And in the next step, you have your answer. Six thousand nine hundred sixty seventy one. This is seventy one. So six thousand nine hundred seventy one is the sum of these two numbers. Now let us generalize this here. See so three digits, three digits. So one eight is left behind. So eight thousand plus two plus one three followed by two zeros. Eight plus two ten followed by one zero, and six plus nine fifteen. So you have your answer eight thousand four hundred fifteen. Eight thousand four hundred fifteen. You can add as you speak because if you speak correctly, you will speak the answer itself. Now see four four digits, four digits. So right from the right, uh, left side, just start adding and write the number of zeros required. 
so 5 plus 3 is 8 followed by 3 zeros 4 plus 5 is 9 followed by 2 zeros 6 plus 4 is 10 followed by 1 zero and 3 plus 6 is 9 so 8000 900 plus 100 is 1000 so 9009 9009 is the required sum now here you have two digits so leave two digits so two digits are three so nine comes in the thousand place so nine thousand two comes in the hundred place so two hundred six plus eight is fourteen followed by one zero and seven plus four is eleven now you can add them nine thousand say two hundred three forty three fifty one so nine thousand three hundred and fifty one is the answer so we will see addition becomes so easy by having a proper outlook towards the numbers if you see the numbers the thing you get in your mind should be the correct thing and instead of going with the traditional method just try and solve this using place value method i am sure you will come out successfully and increase your speed of addition many times so if you like it share it and kindly do subscribe the channel